And in this video, what I'm going to be doing is walking you through a ClickFunnels membership review and give you an example of just how simple it is to set up even if you don't have a lot of tech skills or you're not good with putting anything that's membership related together, you're gonna have no problem with it whatsoever. In fact, this is probably one of the best membership portals I've ever used and I've used a lot of them before, okay? Especially a lot of the big name ones. But before we begin, if you are interested in even just testing out ClickFunnels, I highly recommend that you click the link down below. What that's going to do is allow you to get more information about ClickFunnels, but even better, you'll be able to get a two week free trial so you can actually go in, play with ClickFunnels, mess around with it a little. I know after you use it just for a little, you're gonna love it as much as I do, and you're probably going to wanna use that for every single type of membership site product or website or whatever you're selling that you have, okay? so. Now that we've got that out of the way, all I did in ClickFunnels was just choose a new type of page or funnel I wanna create. I went with the membership one, and what happens is that it brings up two pages right here. Simple as that, two pages that are already created for you. Now bear with me, when I'm recording the screen, it's in you know 720, so I can only make the screen so small or so big. Normally it's going to look like this, but when I do that, you can't see the entire screen. So I'm gonna keep it like this for a little, then I'll go back to show you what I'm talking about. So all you have to do is pick your templates. For me, I love the clean versions of a lot of things, so I'm just gonna go with the simple one. It's gonna load for a little, it's gonna create the page, and then basically you're gonna be good to go with that one. All right, perfect. So that's the first step. Next, let's go to the membership area. It's gonna be the same exact thing where all you have to do is create your template. You don't have to fuss around with, you know, try to put a ton of things together. Once again, I love the simple setup. And the great thing about all of these is that they were 100% customizable. You can change around the fonts, you know, the, the letters, the, the header size, the color, anything you wanna to do to add, to remove, completely up to you. But that's why they're templates. It's very easy for you to get started. And of course, you can always edit them as you go on, okay? So these are the only two pages you're going to have to kind of do stuff with. So first and foremost, let's go to this one here. I'm going to show you how to edit it very quickly. All right, awesome. So this is obviously just a placeholder where maybe you have a logo. Maybe if you brought them in for a product, okay, you could say, you know, congratulations, because it's always a great decision when someone invests, when you have an offer, product, membership, whatever it's going to be. Obviously, you can change around the font, something like that, make it bold, okay? Maybe if that's too close to the top of the screen, you can change it around a little. Let's go over this one. I'm moving very quick, I know. I'm just very used to using this, and let's just say we don't like that padding in between there. We can move this up. Oops, wrong one. Excuse me. There we go. Create your account. So what would happen is, if someone had never signed up before, they would get sent to the create account section, okay? If someone has already signed up, what would happen is it would go to the login area, which is basically on the same page. And the cool thing about it is you only have to edit this one page, okay? So all you would really put here is, you know, congratulations. Maybe you wanna put a video of yourself welcoming your new members, whatever it's going to be, a very plain and simple, um, you know, create your account page will do. It'll work wonders easy to do, email, password, password, and you're done, okay? So very simple to do, that's the first page, one out of two pages, I know it's very complex here. I'm sorry that this is a little bit too simple for you. Apologies in advance, right? So let's go to the membership area section. Now there's a couple things you can do here. First, what I wanna do is actually open this in the editor. This is going to be kind of the skeleton of your membership site. So what can happen here is you can add your logo, you can change around the colors, for example, background color, eh. <laughs> just showing you by example, I probably wouldn't make it red, but just kind of giving you an idea. Category name, okay, so you can change around the text color, the background color, uh, the uh, font obviously. Uh, this is gonna be an example of what this looks like. So the membership content, what font do you want it to be? There's not a whole lot that's going on here. Like I said, this is just the skeleton. So right here, dashboard, you can also put a link where maybe you wanna log in, you wanna log out. If you're looking for support, of course, you can put that at the bottom, maybe a terms of service, whatever you're gonna put there, obviously. And that's basically how you edit the skeleton. So once again, very simple. I know I'm not doing anything complex, but that's the beauty of ClickFunnels is there's some 
simplicity and how simple they make it for anyone, even if you've never created a membership site before. The first time I tried this, I basically got it. And I'm like, oh, that wasn't too bad at all. All right, so let me maximize this again. This is where you're gonna actually edit your section. So what can happen here, this would be, let's say the, you know, the first section, let's do restrict access. Let's call this introduction. Okay, and this is how you actually limit it. So when someone purchases, the only way it's gonna show up is if they purchase this product or this product, okay? But since this is an example, I'm just going to leave it like that. If you wanna add an extra lesson to it, you go to add new lesson. Okay, we're gonna put it in the introduction section. And let's just say, you know, getting sure started. Okay, now we can select the template. Usually if it's gonna be a video, anything video related, you can do that. Or if you wanna do a resource list, this is great for downloads, this is great for text, for PDF, for files, anything like that. For the sake of this example, just so you can get a good idea of what everything looks like, let's do the resource list. And of course, Drip is perfect. It's not a membership site without having a Drip option. So if you wanna kinda of feed the information as the days go on, this is great where if you wanna unlock content after a week, a day, a month, a year, it's completely up to you, but for the sake of this example, let's do zero so that everyone has access to this as they purchase. Now, if we wanna edit these specific sections, we go to open editor. Let me minimize this. All right, perfect. So like I talked about, this is going to be great for if you have any type of text files, any downloads. Heck, what you can also do is you put a video file here and there's a way where once you put a video, you can click on the video, it'll open up as a bigger video and you can watch a presentation from there. You can obviously add anything here for downloads. So let's say we're linking to a PDF, that would be the text and this would be, you know, www yourwebsite.com slash download and so on and so forth. Okay, I'm not gonna obviously finish that out. And that's basically how it would look when it comes to any type of lesson plans, any downloads, anything like that. Let's stay here. Okay, so now let's open this back up. Let's go to the open editor. All right, I completely forgot that the lessons, I didn't include any of the video ones. So let me do that right now. So add new lesson. This is gonna be introduction. This is going to be introduction, so let's just do last section, all right? Obviously, you probably wouldn't call it that, but just for the sake of example, let's do a video lesson. Awesome, okay, and you can obviously, uh, you can move these up and down as well. Completely up to you how you wanna order them. And let's open in editor, just to give you an idea of what the video aspect looks like. All right, I mean, just look how simple this is. <coughs> I mean, just look how simple this is. So we could title this, you know, how to get started. And then the little caption could be something like, watch this video for the fast, uh, you know, track uh, method for getting started. Okay, something like that. This is very simple when it comes to videos, okay? You have your own custom embed, you can do a YouTube video, all you need is the URL. You can do Vimeo like I like doing, all you need is the URL. Wistia URL, and of course, if you're doing any type of HTML5, which I've personally never used, but if you wanna do that, completely up to you, that's how you would do it, okay? You would just insert that link into there. Once again, you're gonna have a text box. This is usually where I add a little bit more where kind of like the cliff notes, you know, like what you're going to go over in this specific video, or most importantly, what I like doing for my customers is actually creating a kind of step-by-step -step action plan. So one of the most important things for me is anytime I'm selling a product, I always want my customers like to know what they need to do next. I never want to have them go through information and then say, all right, that was awesome, but what am I supposed to do? So what I like doing is cliff notes and also action steps. Okay, so it would be like after going through this video, you know, step one, create your membership site. Step two, add content, not, not D. There we go, add content, okay? And then down here, if you wanna use this, that's fine. If you don't, all you do is delete them. Let's say it a, a bonus file for this specific spot. This would be the, you know, membership cheat sheet. Okay, like how to get up and running as quickly as possible. So that's just an example of what that would look like. And let me exit out of that. And pretty much that's exactly how you go about building it. All you would need to do is just add new lessons. And what you can also do, which I haven't showed you yet, you can add a new 
let's see, lesson section, there we go. So this would be, you know, module two, create section. And then now that we have a new section, we can do add new lesson. This would go under that module. And let's just do test, as I've done many times before, video lesson, create lesson, and so on and so forth. And that's basically how it would go. Like I said, very simple. You're not gonna find any other type of way of setting up a membership site that is easier than ClickFunnels. And I've used a lot of them, okay? So I can honestly say that I'm a part of a lot of them right now, <laughs> just because a lot of them, you know, obviously are, are doing well for me profit-wise. So I'm not gonna just, you know, cancel a plugin when I have a lot of customers going through and getting information in the process, okay? So I do highly recommend ClickFunnels. That's from someone with a lot of experience. That's also with someone who didn't really know what they were doing when they first started but figured it out very quickly and that's the reason why I recommend it to you. Does that make sense? It's very newbie friendly. It's really going to help you out, especially when it comes to growing your online business. So if you want more information about ClickFunnels, do be sure to click the link down below. What I'm going to do is send you a little bit more information about ClickFunnels, but more importantly, also get you that link so you can get a two week free trial of ClickFunnels. That way you can do exactly what I just showed you. Load it up, make sure it's perfect for you, and then simply go from there. Simple stuff, right? Either way, thank you for watching. Go ahead and click that link down below and have an awesome day. Hey, really quickly, I just want to let you know that when you click the link down below, it's actually going to take you to a page that looks like this where there's a video playing, but of course I paused it so it won't talk over me. And all you got to do is enter your best email address, create your password, and then enter your information and you'll be good to go where you can start your free 14-day trial of ClickFunnels, okay? Just making sure I got that out there. So be sure to click the link down below and enjoy.